<laughs> we're on, guys. You probably hear the uh, the echo. We're Nick. We are in a haunted school. We're in a a school, a school that we are checking for reported check. activity. Check. check one, two, check three, four. Um, guys, we're a ghost crier. My name's Aaron G. Thompson. We got Nick Simons behind the camera. Jared, rest in peace. Wherever he's at. He's probably Alan um, Chillaxon, isn't he? Um, we got Kelly hidden in one of the one of the rooms here. We'll do a, a typical, you know, session to see where it drives the conversation, guys. We do got three stories with it to ourselves. Kind of awesome. Uh, Ghostcrier.com. You're watching this on Vidida Space, the haunted space. Let's do this. This is an awesome, awesome avenue, awesome location, guys. And. Super stoked. This is, this is constantly vibrating. It's, it's finally broken, isn't it? Yep. Can't shoot it from that angle. Go somewhere <laughs> where I can put the camera. Fine. So, per the owner's request, I have to Super yeah, watch the, uh, the footage sometimes. There's we, constant we, vibrations. <coughs> nah. We'll put that, uh, you can keep holding it on that end. They're coming up right behind you. All right, all the uh, unseen guests here, the past students, the individuals who recognize this location as a spot that you want to reside at. Uh, my name again is Aaron G. Thompson. We got Nick Simons over there. Um, we want you to share your story uh, with us. Let me all pull this closer to me. Um, yeah, can you? Well, say, you know, if we can get it, let's get it. What's the, what's the name of the place that we're at? <laughs> this device allows you to speak with us. It's, it's weird. It's awkward. I get it. You want to touch. One of these devices and speak. It helps it a little bit easier. If you, this is what? There's a sign over there. I can't shoot from that angle. Son of a... The difficult is recording, guys. So let's, let's do this. I want to know that this is working. Um... <laughs> There's a, do you want to give a message? To let me know it's working, I'm hearing you. What's your name? What's your name? Can you give us, start off there. Harry. Harry or? Ian. Is it Ian? Jonathan, I heard Jonathan. That was pretty. Jonathan. Jonathan Illet. Does that does that make sense with anyone? Jonathan said it was lit. <laughs> Don't do what? <laughs> We're just here to speak with you, everyone. There, I fix. Did you, there we go. Um, can you say the name of the building we're in? Is that something you're able to do? <laughs> Not sketchy uh, spot right uh, there. Too far away, can't even see it. <laughs> Maybe if I just hold the camera like this the there entire time. Yes, there we go. Now brought to you... <laughs> Ghost Cryer now brought to you in science vision. It's like a HUD display on a video game. Okay. <laughs> we'll put it down here. So uh, this is this is fun, guys. Can you? Again, I, I want to know if this device is working. I know it's exciting for you. For you. For you. Um, can you please say say the name? Of, uh, of one of our producers. Let's go on TV, guys. This is kind of cool. You know, you guys are in the theater, the arts, and uh, some of you may be. Um, 
Can you say Nicholas Groff? <laughs> Sound like who is that? It's, it's our producer, it's our boss. Oh. Yes, it's her boss. Almost? Oh. Say Nicholas Groff or Elizabeth Saint? The way these sounds are, are produced, they're the instruments that the uh, the spirits or the, the energy is able to use to manipulate. So they kind of like MP3s, small bursts, so it's really hard to get a lot of con context from them. Um, we're trying to get multiple syllables, that's why I say Nicholas. Uh, and what did you guys do here? When you when you guys here, what was this place or what is this place now? Did you just say race? Because if you said race, that's pretty damn interesting. Sure. I get a little bit of reverb, guys. Which I don't like as much anymore, but let's give it a shot. Can you guys say Aaron Thompson? What are we doing? We're filming a, uh, a TV show it's for a network that a lot of people are going to see, and we're trying to tell your story. We research afterlife. Um, it's not an easy path to go down. So if you can help us as, a, as maybe past performers or maybe teachers, instructors that are then and now, please help us. Help us with this moment here. We're going to be here for a little bit of time. What do you need to do? Okay. Let's start off with some easy, easy questions. We're gonna have you repeat. Can you guys say Nicholas Simons? Simons? Simon. <laughs> Can you say Aaron Ta? <laughs> Wait. Look, every time he stands like this, I just want to go. <laughs> you know, we might have got a Nicholas Simons. It kind of came in choppy. Thank you. I definitely Thank you heard an and. What type of classes are studied here? Can you guys tell us? Orb. Something just went thump yeah, back there. Yeah, I got to swing the camera down. Bro, I got to swing it low again. You get to watch Aaron's feet. Wait, where did that noise come from, guys? Sounded like it was over here. Is it in this room? The gym. Censoring the video per the owner's request. And you go stand in the middle right there. That's pretty good there. Nothing too great. Well, <laughs> all, all the way down in the middle. Just 
add a little love and Was there a noise that happened in this room a moment ago? Hey, Jonathan, can you tell us the name of this uh, school that we're in right now? Anybody see that hair that just went like bleh? Something just went bleh right past you there. Hmm. It was real long. I mean, it would probably look like. Really? Yeah, just like that. The owner said that she saw hair <laughs> earlier on the other sure. cameras. Hmm. Maybe you need to work on your string energy theory. <laughs> <laughs> Someone just walked past us? Yeah, because we've seen a little, little right on past. Not you? Are you here for the school or are you here for the fair? Because that could be the case too. You either died in an accident at the fair during a horse race or we rode. Or you really enjoyed just coming to the fair. Oh, yeah. A little bit of a breeze right by me. Yeah, it's very breezy down in the basement, so. I'm sure. I mean, big halls, guys. So, tell us, we're in a classroom right now, and we, we want to learn, we want to learn more about the uh, afterlife, when we pass. Tell us something that us fleshy humans do not know, or are not aware of, um, that you can share, please. Secrets. Secrets. <laughs> This is not healthy. How many people are standing in this room right now? Can you guys tell us where Kelly is right now? What? Where's Kelly? <laughs> should, should I go downstairs, should I go upstairs, or should I go straight through this door? stairwell but I know Kelly's on that side so <laughs> the magic of television <laughs> oh 
All right, guys, as we enter our classroom here. What, what happens here? What, what goes on in this area? <laughs> Maybe I said it. Again. Well, here's a, I think you called it, I heard witch earlier. There's a familiar face. <laughs> Can you guys tell us, who's this? Can you say her name, please? Ashley. <laughs> it's not Ashley. No, no. <laughs> good, good try. <laughs> Ashley was my father's name. <laughs> We might have got it. Let me introduce you to uh, Kelly McCarville, guys. Can you say Kelly McCarville? With two C's? What? Pronounce both of them. Okay, guys, we'll, we'll come back to some of these communication devices in a moment. Let's, let's see if you guys can, uh, can cooperate with some of the other tools. We'll, we'll continue your story, see if we can get anything. I know we got Jonathan we spoke with. Um, we'll speak with you in a moment. Can the guys say, talk to you later? Good. Yes. Yes, you can. Ashley, can you say, talk to you later? Is Ashley the name of the woman that I saw walk into this room? What? Here, not here, guys. Oh, Jesus. Too exciting. <gasps> Nick Simons? What is the name of the lady that I saw walk into the room that drew me down into this area in the first place? D. That was pretty good, Kelly. There. I thought I heard it, but I wasn't sure. I heard that too. We're gonna to talk to Kelly. We're gonna give her the floor, guys. We'll be back with you in a moment, okay? Sweet, sweet, sweet. That's what it sounded like. Sweet. Right on, dude. Is that cool, cool, cool. Ah, Kelly. Hey. Hey. Hi. So, oh, it's moving on its own. Oh my god. Look at this. Da, 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 da. Yeah, it's not nearly paranormal, but. <clears throat> oh, look. But it bumped into the back of my leg, I might have jumped a little. Ha! Here, my kids. Oops. Are we just gonna lose the car? Fire escape. Um, little doggy door. So, uh, you were drawn in this room. When we came into the building originally and we were standing out talking to the owner. Thanks, camera guy. The, there's um, certain things I can't film in this room and if I backed up any further. <laughs> um, when we originally came in and we were standing out talking to the ladies that let us into the building, um, I was kind of looking around, looking around with my, with my brain, with my, with my senses. Um, I very clearly saw a woman walk into this room and I could see her through the window of the door 
but she didn't stop at the wall. She kept walking back into this corner. Um, when I was she didn't go through. She did she go through anything as far as I didn't, didn't see know? a wall. Okay. I could just see her. Okay. So I didn't know that there okay. was a wall okay. there until I came down actually and looked through the glass. Um, now when I was telling the lady that let us in, she thought I was talking about the room next to this because that's where she has also felt a presence, I guess. Um, this was the room I was drawn to, but interestingly enough, this classroom, used to be a classroom, um, has a, a utility closet, like a coat closet in here, but it connects to the classroom next door where she has felt the lady as well. So um, I don't know if maybe it's the same lady that wanders back and forth. Maybe. Okay. Mm. Um, I don't Many know. Rooms I were associated at one I didn't point. necessarily get that okay. when I was sitting here, but maybe just the rounds too. She very know. clearly walked into this room. Okay. Um, I wasn't really getting her while I was sitting down here waiting for you guys. Um, the only thing that I really got was um, more of a residual. I was about to say, is a residual? Is it? Yeah, a lot of what I've been getting here okay. has been residual okay. stuff. Just kind of little flashes of things that had happened before. She was really the only here. thing that I saw. Okay. Um, with the exception of sitting there with my back to the closet, which you know how much I love to have my back open to stuff, um, but it kept feeling like things were kind of messing with my hair a little bit. And so I was checking. I mean, there was nothing that should have been touching my hair, but. I was also sitting with my back open, so I'll... You know, Nick caught a, a string, like, hair go across the yeah, camera. Yeah, it literally went... Blah, just like that, I mean, and it looked like really? something about yay wide. Well, that's really cool. Kick, kick, kick. And it just went blah, right on by, so... Well, and this was just kind of this the little feeling that anybody who's long hair who does ghost hunting probably felt it before, where it just feels like they take those little strands of hair and just kind of play with them, and it... They're collecting Happened sample pieces. More, yeah, well, yeah. you know, because I'm a witch. They right. need it for the original. Yes, yeah. She's a witch. <gasps> witch, witch. Oh, no. Mm -hmm. um, I would guess the lady that I saw felt like a teacher. I don't know how to explain it other than she felt like a teacher, authority, which makes authority. sense. Wait. Um, if you lived on a beach, would you be a sand witch? Slash sandwich, guys. Hashtag sand witch. You're a funny guy. Continue. Um, <laughs> that's it. <laughs> yeah, there's nothing. Make show. Now, <laughs> make no show. That. That's it. End show. Boop. <laughs> so. Ah. Um. But for the most part, I mean, um, it's pretty, I mean, mind you, my feelings are broken. But it's a pretty welcoming place. I yeah, mean, I don't feel anything bad in here at all. It feels pretty comfortable. Um, even when I was sitting in there and something right. was kind of playing with my hair, it wasn't uncomfortable. It just felt like kids kind of playing with your hair. Um, the, yeah. She felt strict. I can tell you that. She felt Ooh. like she was very strict. Um, Maybe a caretaker at some point? Or? I would have guessed her to be a teacher. Okay. A caretaker? I don't know. Someone who washed over the establishment. What the hell's wrong with you? <laughs> Caretakers, they come in. A of caretaker at a school? Could, it wasn't always a school. He didn't have much book learning. <laughs> I don't do reading book things. He's right from now. Illinois. I'm getting a ruler across <laughs> there. So, residually, yes. uh, we're faced with two different things here. We're faced with the school activity, but we're also faced with the fairground activity that used to be here before the school. So, right where we're standing inside of the building used to be the center of the horse racetrack. And the fair, the grandstands would have been right outside of the front door of the school. So, is there maybe any of that? I mean, late eighteen hundreds, people could have died at the horse racetrack that might still be here, or it's the exciting energy of being at the race because you know at that time people really just had right. blow the candle out and that was it for the day. <laughs> I mean, I I would definitely think that there could be some residual energy, yeah. energy for that. I almost wonder if we went outside more. Um, if we would feel that. I, I haven't picked up any of that yet. Right. But, um... And in some for everybody cases, playing at home, that's the history of this place. <laughs> <laughs> in, in some cases, um, it could very well be a, a visiting uh, entity, someone who, who deemed themselves maybe an authority figure elsewhere, and somehow there's still activity and those functions going on here today, so maybe they came after. I'm just kind of an idea, but... We don't know. She feels yeah. like she belongs here. Okay. 
I'll say you can't feel like you belong when you're not here alive. I don't know. She's don't a know. lunch lady. <laughs> I don't think she was a lunch lady. Yeah, I don't think she was a lunch lady. But huh. um, but really, all I saw of her was just walking into the room. She didn't do anything when I. But then I kind of right. could only see her so far into the room too. Um, Did she look? Period. Uh, she had on a white top and a blue skirt, like a navy blue skirt that was longer, but it wasn't like completely floor length. So that's got to put her at a certain fifties. Yeah, I was gonna say that's got to put her at a certain age because God forbid you show, showed your ankles. Yeah. So she's wearing white after Labor Day. My God. Oh my gosh. The nerve. The nerve. Ashley. Oh. Ha. <laughs> no, uh, I don't think she's Ashley. Uh, all right. Uh, cool. Well, let's say we kind of trot upstairs. We'll see what we feel up there. We'll run the the SB and see if we can get some some hits off of this. And yeah, because like dominoes, you guys got thirty minutes. <laughs> Whoa! The mirror. Scariest thing I've seen all night. Mirror shot. Well, <gasps> Oh, that's gosh. <laughs> Are you going up these stairs? These? Or the other stairs? Uh, we can end up at the other stairs. You hear that? That door shutting? Okay. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Look, now Aaron gets the butt shot. Normally it's Kelly. But I did her a favor this time. <laughs> Stand over. There you go. Yep, there we go. All right, everyone uh, who's followed up here, who's, who's interested in what we're doing, you might see a little bit of a haze coming from this device, perhaps. If you can manipulate that haze, uh, tug on it, use uh, those lights and light them up a little bit more, it allows us to know that you're there because science says bad boys can't be free floating if it goes off. So we just need to document this stuff, guys. If you can help us out, that'd be awesome. We much appreciate that. Let me swing around and take over from the camera. Ugh, camera. So I can hold the camera over my head just to get a face shot of this guy. <laughs> Hi. What's, uh, what's your name? Uh, my name's Nick, and this is my first day of school here. Uh, my mom dropped me off. I'm real excited. I'm looking for So, me. Nick's mom. Uh, <laughs> oh, man, I do not want to take responsibility for that. No, no, no. <laughs> Tell us, did it hurt? <laughs> Was it a natural birth? <laughs> Your poor mother. Oh, gosh. That should be the next show. Nick's poor mother. Nick's poor mother. <laughs> on Viddy.Space. CBS. <laughs> yeah, on CBS. So... Nick, you probably, do you, you have your gear here, don't you? Yeah, it's downstairs. Oh, it's downstairs, okay. Now you say a little something. Oh, oh okay, I've got it. <laughs> so, yeah, um, we gotta give him a ghost cryer fanny pack. Right? What are those fancy vests? I like that. Um, so yeah, uh, old school building. Super fun time here. Um, I don't know what to say. Um, <laughs> You're doing good. <laughs> You're doing good. Um, Kind of what I was saying downstairs is there's just a lot of residual energy. That's a lot of what I'm picking up. Um, so the hallways obviously feel more energetic. Right. Um, than the classroom that I was in downstairs. Um, watch, you don't catch anything else. Yeah. yeah, everything's pretty blurred. Okay. Um, um, Are you picking up something or are you just having a moment? Nick that I just heard. I did hear something downstairs. I'm assuming that's Nick. I'm assuming it was Nick, yeah. Though we did hear something in that area before when you were in that room that took, took us in the classroom. Okay. Um, which we caught the hair. Mind you, we don't, I haven't even reviewed the footage. It's just fascinating everyone that we, that Nick saw a hair piece and he, I don't think he was there for the conversation when the lady said that she caught an interesting piece of hair in one of her cameras. Oh, that's right. Right. 
So, I forgot all about that. Yeah, I, I don't feel he was there in, on the conversation. Um, so I, that's why that's why I'm pulling back to the hair so much. I'm, I'm going to view it, and I mean it's probably a hair, but hey, let's 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 look at it. It is what it is, but we'll yeah. I have not seen it, so you guys have seen it at this point before me. Hair or no hair? Right. Yeah. I love how they still have the lockers in here, though. Dramatic shot. I was saw. <laughs> Did you like cough while you were downstairs? Be honest. I may have. I forgot already. <laughs> it was so long ago. Right. I just remember dinner's at Long John Silver's tonight, so I'm looking forward to that. Also, just for the owner's sheer entertainment, I'm going to actually record and analyze this SP7 session. What? With the, with the one shots, of it's always it's always just been bam. What you hear is what you get. So, can you tell me the name of the town? Oh, hello. <laughs> let, let, let's start over. Hi, my name's Nick. I know this who we is are Kelly, right this is Aaron, and the device in my right hand is a FM radio. You know what a radio is. You probably sat around listening to the stories on the radio. This radio happens to be broken, but it's broken in your favor. You should be able to manipulate the sounds that come out of these speakers to manipulate them into your voice trying to tell us stuff. So, with that, can you say hi really loud to let us know that you're here talking with us? Oh, oh in a second, one second. When you hear it go. Anticlimactic. Yeah, wow. Jeez. Oh. I got all sorts of excited. I am just owing nothing on it. <laughs> now, can you say hi? I got a high right there, I think. Can you hear yourself? What grade went to school in this building? What was the, what was the highest grade? spirits here or is it all just a replay of time and moments <laughs> again like a male cough downstairs but this time you're not down there so Ooh. I heard something like a almost I mean I'll, I'll say it like a pipe or, or something type hit there is of course an active theater that's attached but that's on that side though the halls echo and how much would that actually I mean Brooke it's not gonna go through easily at no. all I mean it's a theater so it's actually made for soundproofing um, and I thought maybe it was something like kicking off the SB7 that it was echoing funny, but he's turned it on and off a couple times and I haven't heard it again. Is somebody downstairs? <laughs> What year 
year was this building built? Let's get some questions going here. town are we in? This is the easy question. You should be able to nail this one as soon as I turn the speaker back on. My guy right away. the best spot in the building to be near the activity the most activity in this building where's it at oh gosh you're laughing Kelly oh well no it, the whole damn thing turned off leave that on for me please where's the best spot for activity <laughs> Film that sign down there. Okay. Alright, here's a good one that if you guys get it right, it'll. Yeah, that's me, that's on that bump something. Yeah. Yeah. I don't like that. Okay. Uh, my if bad. you guys get Sorry, this one right, the, the woman that showed us around earlier, what's her name? That's it. That's it. Alright, so for everybody watching I don't at home. I know if they, because it's yeah. kind of unique. Yeah, we're, we're, we're not going to tell you her name, but that's just an inside joke for us to know, right, Aaron? <laughs> this is so funny. This is great. So many inside Actually, jokes. Actually, I'm, I'm going to. You guys present, are your own investigators here. <laughs> I'm going to present that to her, the, the, the woman that owns the building. She's going to. And her. for nine ninety nine, we could present. <laughs> no, just, yeah. if you If you hit the tip your favorite show button down yeah. below the screen, right down there, we too will present that audio to you uh, with the mm. correct answer. Um, Kelly thinks she keeps hearing somebody downstairs and it's driving me nuts. Do you, do you think somebody's down there? the last class held in this building what year was the last time it was a school like an uh, actual school school I know it's a school now but when was it a school for children's <laughs> five in there. This should be really easy. What locker number do I have open? There you go. Oh. Oh. 
Eighty-one. No, I heard the eight, eight though. Eighteen, yeah. I heard the eight. Good job, guys. That's kind of cool. I hear the eight too. I heard the eight there. Cool. Uh, How much time you got left? We got here. Give about twenty minutes, and then, guys, this show is concluded. <laughs> dun, dun, dun. Kelly, do you, do I want to hand you this? Yeah, I was gonna to say, you want me to take that? Yeah. Now this is Kelly Vision. So, oh, anyway, shit. so it's just gonna be. Watch it drop a foot. Don't. Crotch shots all day long. You're welcome, ladies. <laughs> and gentlemen. Ooh, hey, will you grab my water if we're moving from here, please? No. Okay, grab my water if we're moving from here, please. It's on the fire alarm. On the fire? Behind you. Oh. Never, never mind, I'll get it. <laughs> so I, I'm committed. Guys, water. We're sponsored by Life Water. No, we're not. Get a lot. Drink water. We're not sponsored. Uh, okay, like, uh, sorry guys, let me get a good hold of this. Okay, it's all shaky. It's shaky all better. Man. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh. You know, this is why you guys don't hand me cameras. Man. Let's see if we go. There's downstairs downstairs. This thing I don't keep looking at. Yeah, probably the side that you did the gym for. Yeah. I do a lot of camera dodging on this one, Kelly, but I'm sure you know. This side over here has a couple little rooms that are kind of neat. Where? This side? Yeah. Hey, Jerry, check down there, didn't you? I went down there first. That was yeah. like, I'm sure you know this guy's recording a super secret here. This is the sort where we become Tomb Raiders. Yeah. We find lost in vaults. What's your base in here, so. Put my lazy boots in the whole time. Like the uh, dead pool pillows. They're nice. <laughs> <laughs> can, can we ever read? That looks pretty dark and suspicious down that way. Oh, it's probably just how you cross over to the other side. Yeah, well, we don't want to cross over to the other side yet. <laughs> I get it. <laughs> they also have security cameras in here, so they're probably picking up some neat IR footage. Some flickers. Oh, maybe. You know what? Let's, uh. I don't want to break anything. So this is a storage room, guys. I have no clue what we may or may, find, may, or may not find in here. Uh, look for the power button. Well, that is old and cool. You're not old and cool. I mean, you're cool. Ouch. Gosh. All right. Um, what room is this I use for, guys? Can you help us out? Hmm? What? Hmm? What room is this? There are some pipes and stuff rattling in the room next to us. Yeah. What do you guys do for fun in this area? When they were asking the question upstairs where you guys go in the building for activity, I got an answer. Tell them what you told me you did. What'd you guys sneak into the basement to do? Hopefully smoke some 
smoke cigarettes. Party. True. Oh. Smoke cigarettes was true? No. Maybe. That's what they told me. Do you guys do you guys have a do you guys have a light you can show us? <laughs> Who is your favorite person to come down here and smoke with? Cool, I just seen a shadow. It's our shadow? Yeah. I think you have the shadow of the uh, dehumidifier right here. Right? And then I was standing back here, so I, you know, you got the curtain blowing. And then all of a sudden it was just like real quick. It just looked just like this, or just Bye. right by. Just, just like that. Like, Who's uh, who's watching us over here, guys? What's your name? Ashlyn. 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 Another Ash something. Is Jonathan, a part of this too. Thanks. Huh? Is Can you guys tell us what do you think we do? What are we doing right now? I'll take that and you go explore whatever oh, it is that you're seeing. Explore what just said my name. All right. Can we go explore? You guys have fun. Say demon? No, don't say that, you bastard. I'm sorry. I just repeated the box. Uh, it said Damon. Nick, you don't have your flashlight on you, do you? No. What's that here? That's just the other side. There's a lot of paraphernalia on that side for the business that operates over there. So. Oh, Jesus. Oh, that was good. There's an air tumbler back there. Can someone say Kelly's name again? <laughs> kind of a fun, uh, fun moment. Can you say all of our names? Say all of our names. So I heard you with my ears whisper my name. What do you want? That's different for me, guys. I'm not used to hearing it with my ears. So it took me a second, but what do you want? Someone's looking for you. Who's looking for me? Around me. I don't know about you guys. Did you shut this off or did I? Uh, you probably did. I touched it, so it's a possibility. What the? Bloody hell. You're you? in the hall? What's going on? This is making noise. Yeah, it's it's batteries are probably getting ready to go poop. <laughs> Where are you guys at in here? Did I hear Susan? Yes. Who's Susan? Kid me. A kid? Kid me. Oh. You're kidding me. Yeah, we can hear you. <coughs> Guys, this is a super cool thing. If you talk, we can hear you. You just need to talk like you normally would. It does help if you touch one of these devices. It helps a little bit. Ouch. Ouch. Don't worry yourself. <laughs> Is it 
fall down? What do you want to tell? What do you want to spill to Kelly? What do you want to tell us? She's a witch. He's making this up. Yeah, but if she lived on the beach. When you call me a witch, is it good or bad? Bad? Okay, now I'm a little bit. Can you guys do us a favor to let us know you're here? And we know you're here, but this is more for documentation. Can, can someone make a noise in this room? A banging noise? That's not the air tumbler running. Yeah, you gotta make it something yeah. loud so we know it's not just the pipe stuffy bit next to We're looking a little bit here, guys. Everybody at home that's watching the curtain behind Aaron and Kelly, there is so much wind moving through here, you have no idea. So if that curtain that's behind Aaron and Kelly is moving, keep in mind this one on this side is sucked in to the room that we're in because all the air is being drawn through here. Oh yeah, that's a good thing to point out so people aren't freaking out. So if you, out. if you if you're seeing the one in the back there moving, chill. What's up with this room? It's just a room with a bunch of stuff in it. I think it might have used to be the cafeteria. No, th this room is the uh, just like a boiler room. Oh, maybe it was just the other side. The other side had a sign on the door that said. Everyone kind of funnel in this room. So, if you guys are calling me a witch, what about the other people that are in this building all the time? Are there others that you think are witches in this building too? Aaron? Aaron's not a witch. Sorry. Do you guys want to leave me a message? You want to leave a message for Nick or Kelly? Part of that guy, say it again, please. Is there a, do you have a question that you want to ask us? Sure. What would you like to ask us?
When you guys were in this building, was it a school or the fairgrounds? Gym. Gym. The damn thing blew in and made it sound like somebody was running up on behind me. I was like turning around, I had my dukes up. There's nobody out there. What's your favorite uh, classroom to watch or theater show to watch? Can you tell us? Turn your head. There you go. Hi. Who just left the room? You got three minutes, buddy. Three? No. Ooh. You guys seem to be very talkative in here. Um, for the sake of the location, I know I've asked this a couple of times, I just want to see if we can be more clear. We have to leave here soon. What's the name of the building we're in? When it was a school with children, what was the name of it? Nick, do you know the answer? Yeah, it's it's engraved on the side of the building. Oh, is it? Yeah. <laughs> yes, I'm observant. <laughs> Always live with their third eye, guys. No, yes. I walk around with my eyes closed most of the time. <laughs> Okay, guys, we're going to wrap things up. Thank you so much for uh, speaking with us. It's a cool place. We very well may come back and do a full full run here if, if able. Um, when? <laughs> uh, it's got to interact with us more, though. We, we, wanna, we like this. We like to share your story the best we can. Really. <laughs> That's all we're here for is just, just to share your story and the information. Kick. What? <laughs> can you guys say goodnight to us? Can you say goodnight or goodbye? We do what? <laughs> we love you guys. Thank you for speaking with us. Thanks again for talking, guys. Goodbye. Good night. Night, guys. We're off. We're off. Peace. It's always a fun time. Right. Guys, well, hey, I think we got some, some decent conversation. We'll check to see uh, some hey. contextual conversation, which is always awesome. Um, Oh, yeah, this was a fun place. I think we had some interesting discovery moments, too. Uh, so, guys, yeah, Nick Simons, Kelly McCarvel, named Jim G. Thompson. Uh, thank you so much. Vinny.space. Check us out on ghostcrayer.com. And if you want to, uh, to pledge towards this, we really do want to drive the field forward more and more and more. And you can do so on patreon.com slash ghostcrayer. 
uh, we're we're stoked to to do more with the field and i believe we have the avenue you know here on vidida space the haunted ass space thank you guys so much peace we love you pan off into the woods pan off into the woods <laughs> <laughs> Hey everyone, you made it to the end of the video. Hi, my name's Aaron G. Thompson, ghostcryer.com. We do this on a, on a standard that um, requires some resources to be uh, provided. Since, we're, since we can't do what we're doing uh, yet um, as a profession, and we still have a nine to five jobs, we do ask that you uh, support you know, patreon.com if you see a value in us. because we really are pushing the field here at Ghost Cryer. Um, or, uh, you know, ultimately just, just check us out on other avenues. We have uh, a show we release on Viddy.Space. You can get a subscription there. Check out Breaking Frequencies. Literally, it's our love letter to the paranormal community, to you. Um, we go uh, break down the historical aspect, uh, the techniques, as well as the science behind it all. Um, it's again, it's really kind of the full package and no current uh, TV show really has all of that going on for it So again, check that out and you can also check it out on Amazon Yeah, Amazon Video Prime. It's a thing guys. So cool. Love you. We're like We're really rated pretty well on Amazon right now, by the way. I don't want to curse us but <laughs> We love you guys. Thank you so much for watching the video Expect more of these one-shot moments to be uh, popping on our channel. Peace, sucker. Love you. Thanks, guys.